Hello, and welcome to a Thursday edition of Robert vs. The New York Times Crossword, best day of the week. Today we're going to do the Thursday, April 18th, 2024 crosswords, and go for that 1,511 day streak. This weekend I'll be out of town, might still post videos, but uh, to be determined. Anyway, here's your spoiler alert for the Thursday mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The mini is always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Anjo, Regal, Alexa, Nanette, Goose, and Odes. Alright. Banjo took me like an extra quarter second longer than I wished. We've got the Genie, Robin Williams, and or Will Smith. The schmear goes here. Little rhyming clue there. Alright, very nice. Anyway, that's the main event. That's the Thursday Daily Grid, which is by David Kwong today. Here's your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. I call Thursday the best day of the week. It's the hard-themed puzzle. It usually involves a trick. And David Kwong is a <coughs> a little a literal crossword magician. Right, as part of his show, he constructs a crossword on stage and he does magic. So pretty cool. Let's see what David Kwong has in store for us. Let's get into it. It might come in a package. Well, this is a very segmented grid. Great creatures. An S here, a count that's been overdrawn a saga. It follows the Hijri calendar. Islam. Musical with Rum Tum Tugger and Mungo Jerry. That's cats. A lot time. Saber Tooth Tiger in the Ice Age movies. I never watched them. Shall we accessories on marching band uniforms? Some are sending an SI that's PDT. Bloomers worn around one's head. A lay? <coughs> I'm not sure. Bygone. Visitor from faraway place. Alice Monroe, maybe. Plumes. UFO. Words before time or story. Defunct here. End of time and end of story. Roguish sorts or scamps. Assist in a foursome. So this is election day. Natural competitor is type A. It's all shake. It'll all shake out. Salt. One way to run. And big mouth. The maw. And is it a muck? Money wave. It is a CPA. I think. Maybe it's CFO. A foul. Maybe that's better. Anime blank. Is it Wong? The false good Samaritan. E.g. Month without a federal holiday, I guess it's August. Okay. Measure of inflation is PSI and Great Apes. Diego. Acre on the ocean floor. Menu fish. Winter frost. Frost is rhyme. For grades K through 12, that's L high. Mother of Pearl, so it's whore. Superman Port Fair is Christopher Reeve. Naker, I see, so we're missing an N there. Ballot time, so we're missing a B, okay? This is Ali, aware of, in on. Beholden to is, B beholden to is O, and clear is net, like you clear the salary. That being said as yet, this is McCartney, bassist. Uh, I guess it is a con. Wood commonly used in mid-century modern furniture, and don't ask an ash, half of dodici. Is it say? Is that Italian? Uh, nascent stage for a bird? Limitless quantity. Oh, it's hatchling. Okay. You can come out ahead. Sight C. Name that's anagram of bread. Uh, I, niece is found on it. The Riviera. Uh, Deborah. Attachment to a bit is a rain, and fireplace bit is an ember. Graceful horse. Director Ryan Johnson. Dead end is numb. Rice remade movie, or when it's parsed as six words, a hint to the theme clues in this puzzle. Small brawl. Days leading up to the next sign. Don't know it. There are kits. Secret retribution is Sue. Something of Greek mythology. Uh, COVID. Like a some kind of a bird. Olympic site was Tokyo. This is a pog yesterday, ASAP. Horse is Ars Poetica. Heavy hearted is just sad. Suffix with cowardice. Gradually slower is retardando. Like some coding loops and measuring cups. 
Sorts. Nested for loops. Milk Sorts. Sartites. Devices with shuttles. Looms. Roundup Sounds. Keter O'Toole? No. Uh, greet the day. So just rise. Perfume name with an accent is Este. Hospital scan is an MRI. Not wavering is set. Cross fit. Knit. An Arab here. Small balls is scrap. Cretan bull. Ovid. Okay. Peter Lorry, right? Moose. Uh, what was this again? Cusp, maybe prison? A star is born. I get it. A star is B or N. A star is B or N. Ballot time. The star there is B. Naker. It's an N. Nice. It's an N. Bovid. It's a B. Nascent. It's an N. And bassist. It's a B. So I think it's equal numbers of N's and B's. A star is B or N, parsed as six words. All right. Uh, honestly, it's an interesting theme, but I sniffed it out very quickly. I think this Naker being Mother of Pearl is too easy. I, mean, I didn't sniff out the the revealer, of course, but. I thought it might be Corvid. Corvid like a crow, but no Bovid. That's a nice clue. Ovid of Greek mythology. Ascent stage. I mean, these clues are pretty nice, honestly. It's a nice revealer. Uh, this grid is super segmented, though. Look at all these black squares going down. Um, there's a lot of theme material. There's seven themers. Um, I think that's a good thing. It didn't feel like there was too much theme material. But it's very possible, I think, in this one to maybe get stuck somewhere if the grid is this segmented. You're not, not used to seeing this much black square stuff in the middle. But yeah, lots of themers. All nice clues. It's a nice puzzle. It's a nice puzzle. Is it a Thursday? Maybe. Could it, the cluing have been toughened up a bit? Also, maybe. Yeah, I guess this is some kind of con. Some way to con people. Pretend to be a good Samaritan and then you try to rob somebody or something. Some of this feels sort of trivia-ish, right? month without a federal holiday. Sort of a trivia way to clue. August. Animal name whose name when capitalized is a major West African language. Interesting. The Eva language? How do I pronounce this? It's in... Can't read this IPA. It used to be that when you would mouse over it, it might tell you how to pronounce it. Like B, but with the lips not quite closed. It's Eva, something like that. Okay, so that's sort of giving you two ways into that. Cusp being included as astrology, didn't know, but that's fine. Moose, if you round up cattle, I see. I tried to watch the newest A Star is Born on a plane and fell asleep. Never seen Ice Age either. Just a bit too old for it. Fine. 
feels a bit trivia heavy, I'll say. Oh, we have Ali Wong in this puzzle. Or Anime Wong and Muhammad Ali. Uh, We have scamps and scrap, those are sort of cousin words, I think. Um, yeah. I wonder how this plays for everybody. It seemed pretty easy, but maybe I knew the trivia. I mean, it is 25% faster than my average, and that actually seems to be the median solver. So probably could have been toughened up a bit, I guess. So for 100% of solvers, don't know how many that is, but... 100% of solvers are solving faster than their average. Probably just a few, but... Alright, nice. Anyway, now for the main event. No, not now for the main event. Let's move on to some more puzzles, starting with the Telegraph Plus Word. Here's your spoiler alert for the Plus Word. There is a link in the description below. It's free to play. It's a British mini crossword meets Wordle at the end. And let's, uh... Let's do it. Brand of vegan spread. Clean between the teeth is just floss. Enjoy as a cat does milk. Is that lap up or something? Ferric oxide, it's rust. Well, the kidneys is renal. The kids, not sure. Laxer. Uh, opine, Sudan, spelt. So the kids aren't all right. Okay. Um, so it's this. It's not alert. Uh, it's not an A here. It's not an E either, so what could it be? Uh, not an N. It's not a P. Uh, so what is it? Oh, it could be elect, right? Yeah, any any hint that there were two E's in this puzzle? In the plus word, rather? Don't think so, but it did give us three of the letters. Um, all right, nice, nice. Let's move on to the code. Oh, you know, I was I had you on the wrong one this whole time. Sorry. There it is. Let's move on to the uh, Telegraph code words. Here's your spoiler alert. There's a link in the description below. Unfortunately, not free to play, but fun to play, I will say. Try to find some ease here. Probably here, I guess. It could be like over something, perhaps. Like overdose, is that? There's a lot of Vs, but those are given to us. Uh, maybe it's an A here. Could this possibly be galore? Maybe this is yearly. Uh, I would want an N. Is this an I? Venice. Okay. Spinning wheel? Like in weaving? Fish cake. Like in food? Reefs? Victoria Cross. We had Victoria Cross not that long ago. We have Q's. Very British. I think this is probably Emu. Jump. Uh, size and Ludo? Who's Ludo? Ludo Bagman? Who is Ludo? A simple game in which players move counters around a board according to throws of a dice. It's a form of Pachisi played chiefly in the British Isles. There you go. Let's try code words regular now. I really want poem here. Could it be poem? No, it can't be. Oh, okay, it could be. What is this, though? Seems like it's a vowel, actually, so this looks pretty bad. Uh, so, nix that. That was a... Could be a lot of other things, honestly. Um, this looks like it could be emergency exit. <laughs> Ever emergency exit? Amazingly, that seems right. Um, assets. Original. That was quite the pull, I gotta say. Zircon. 
Um, horizontal bar. Homespun. Aqua. Groove. Joyous. Deli. Ski. Kung Fu. And Nephew. All right. It's able to pull emergency exit from this. Proud of that. Proud of that. All right, let's end as we always do on the New York Times Connections puzzle, where we try to make four groups of four. So we got here dirt, mind, share, regard, post, intelligence, follow, stake, observe, interest, column, secrets, pull, percentage, pillar. Dirt. This could be right. Interest percentage share stake, maybe. Observe, mind, regard, and follow. And then post poll pillar column. That seems right, actually. I think that's right. Gathered by spies. What do I think is next hardest? I think poll pillar post is easy. Probably it's this, then. That's right. And then probably it's observe, follow, mind. Regard. Green. Yep, there we go. Nice. Figured out all four pretty quickly there. Pretty quick puzzling day. Happy about that. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. Probably I won't see you tomorrow for some Friday puzzles, but I probably will see you sometime this weekend for some more puzzles. See you then.